here, here's the problem with this. In the real world, there are Muslim villains. They are our enemies, these jihadists now. So you're basically transferring that onto the screen into a compelling drama and a realistic drama because this guy's supposed to be protecting us from those Muslim villains. So I don't know how you can not do that in this day and age. Well, you know, on one hand, people talk about its realism, and then on the other hand, they use, you know, the fact that it's fiction to defend themselves. The fact that we've become so desensitized in this post-9-11 world to this, you know, very, very, uh, you know, real uh, phenomenon that we deal with, yes. But when shows paint an entire demographic group as being complicit in terrorism, when they have, you know, Muslim families as the next sleeper cell, you know, obviously to, to Americans who don't know anything about Muslims or Islam, it's going to give them a lot of pause when they deal with their Muslim friends, neighbors, and co-workers.